what's the deal? It's your boy 12. 12 by and if you seen my last video, then you already know how sad and frustrated and how depressed looking like a lost puppy I was at the end of my last video, y'all. I went two and one. And the one came from Showtime Anthony Pettis. Spamming the capoeira kicks. And I don't even feel like talking about it anymore. Because if I don't talk about it, if I get I feel like crying. But I'm not going to do that. Not on camera. So I am about to go it on. And start again. So, as you all know, on my previous videos, all three of those fights was with George St. Pierre. And my George St. Pierre is on a, a quest to regain his claim. Regain his fame. However you want to say it. And he had a minor setback with Showtime Anthony Pettis. And to be honest, GSP is going to meet him again. My GSP is going to meet him again, and I am going to be prepared for all the kicks that he throw. It just sucks. What sucks even more is that I don't even know how to do the specialty kicks, to be honest. I got to create a fighter. Excuse me. Had to go get hydrated with some uh, Power 8. I have a creative fighter. By the name of uh, Nightmare. So I bite the Nightmare. Look, here it is again. Showtime, Manny Pettis. Yes, I am ready, y'all. The rematch is here, but no time to waste. Man, I wonder if it's the same guy. I didn't even check his name. But uh, yeah. So I gave him, you know, a specialty kick, man. But only I don't know how to do him. I do the button commands and they don't work. But anyway, I gotta focus, y'all. This dude is this, this, this dude is mine. Already, eh? Feels like I'm fighting the same guy. Yeah, it feels like I'm fighting the same guy. Like I said, I got a game plan. Every time you throw a head kick, we're going straight for the body. <laughs> he just casually takes his his leg out. Oh, this is oh, this is just unbelievable. This is just unbelievable here. Look, I, I can't get up. I give it to him, y'all. He, this jujitsu is on a one. 
I don't know about Anthony Pettis, but uh, you know the guy who's using him. Jiu Jitsu is on the one. Like he, he knows how to exploit the system. But the only reason he did that is because I I, I found a, a knack to beating him, and he knows it. Look, as you can see, he's holding his body. He knows it. He didn't even hit me in my head. So yeah, guys, I really think this is the same guy that I fought last time.
Wow. What a dramatic ball. I won. What an outstanding back I won. The rematch, y'all. I won. And it should leave a huge impression in the judges' minds as they render their decision. I believe that. them down. I won. Fight. I think it got the decision. Round two. That was a mission of times I swept him off his feet. What, three times? Round three. The legs buckle, and he's down. Two knockdowns to one. Is in, and here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, of these all bad stuff for decision. Judge one scores the contest 29 28, St. Pierre. Judge two scores it 8 29, Pettis. And Judge three scores it 9 28, declaring the winner by split decision. George, yes, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Work. Let's do work, man. Those dudes are focused right there. Yes. That's what I'm talking about, man. Told you, man. I had a game plan for that youngin. I put in work. The hell are you talking about? Man. First fight was a fluke, man. Let's look at the stats. Two knockdowns, there's one. 14, same amount of significant strikes, even though he threw more. Uh, threw around the same amount of strikes. I landed more. Successfully got all two of my takedowns. One submission attempt, six round passes. So, yeah, I won. Look at the stats, you might say, yo, Pettis should have won. Well, I was more effective than Pettis.